So this is Terry. I tried to get her to sit up because it would be more flattering. And Terry, tell them what you want to, she was rehearsing what to say. And I told her we really, we don't rehearse things around here. Okay. So show them what you did. But don't. See this? Well, I'm not. I, I don't mean, like it when people call it a turkey neck, though, because I like turkey Well, neck. what do you want me to say? It is not, you know, pinch an inch. <laughs> well, this is not pinch an inch of fat. This is pinch an inch of skin. If we could just take and, like, look. You see that? That's not good for it to pull like that. So, well, well. So, tell I, me what you want to say. What are you thinking? I want it gone. Okay. Like, see all those wrinkles right there? See that? So we're gonna do some. Look at um, that. Look at that. That bothers me when I'm ready for more. Thank you, Christina. I don't know what that means, but I just fished it. Okay, you remember when you did your C the CRT on cool. me, and I told you when I turned my head upside down mm -hmm. that my face would kind of go to the bottom. Yeah. Okay. Now when I'm getting dressed in the morning and I'm putting makeup on, the face still looks good from the CO2. But then I look right here and I'm like, Christina, I'm sorry, I'm way more into this. Christina, does yes. that mean you can talk to us? I've never seen that. It said him tap to invite, and I just invited her. Hi, Christina. I wonder if she can. Oh well. Okay, I'll get over it. But oh, Christina, if you can talk, talk, because I want to hear. Okay, so your neck is bugging you. What else is bugging you? So what she has here, she's got some extra skin. She's busy, and she doesn't follow directions, so no. surgery is not a good option. <laughs> no, I don't follow directions. At the moment, but there's a little bit of fat there. So when you have a little bit of fat and some skin, we can use Kybella. If you Google Kybella, it'll scare you to death because it there's a lot of swelling and can be, but I'm not going to do enough for that to happen, and Terry will tune in with you all every day and show you. Yes. So we're just going to put, I'm going to put a small amount because luckily there is a little bit of fat. If there wasn't fat and it was just skin, I couldn't do that. So tell me about the Botox. Where are we going to do that? Well, we don't need to have the study lines. Where what are I, they called? Study lines. I like that better than the other. Study, it's like concentration to where I look like I'm concerned. You know. I like that. I don't, really don't like when people use animals to talk about lines, like turkey neck, crow's feet. Well, no, I just don't like that at all. Yeah. Well, but gonna, this is concentration, like staring at the computer. And I, you, you trained me. I try not to squint. So but we're going to do please. a little bit of Botox, and in a couple of days, what Botox is going to do, smile. See how her eye pulls down? I'm going to be able to put a little bit there, so smile again. Imagine, well, smile for real, Terry. <laughs> it squishes her eye closed, so I'm going to put a little bit of Botox, and what that's going to do is when she smiles, it's not going to pull the lateral brow down. And then we can do some in her forehead. Squeeze your brows together. This muscle pulls the corrugator. It's in and down, so when I put some there, it's going to come up a little bit. And then show them this side. Smile. You see how much that pulls it down? So when I relax that muscle, it's going to let it come up. So, Christina, if you can do anything, do I want to see what you can do when you're invited and you're in. Somebody tell me, because I think it's really cool. I mean, you want to... Okay. You just got to... All right, everybody, send me support. Send me some love, some hearts, some thumbs up. Am I getting any? It looks like we're still just looking at Christina. Wait, here we are. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can't? You can just say hey? Am I, getting I can't hear else? you. I said, and do I, you want to invite her to the broadcast? I was trying to figure out what that meant. I guess I'm not going to find out today. Do we number which one? Yes. Yes, I got none. Um, Am I getting first, support? Lots of support? I need support. The, Kybella. the first thing in the Cabela, will you sit up like you're... <laughs> Study in. Wait, like sit up, up. So I don't want to do Cabela past this line because it can weaken, it can go to some, go to the nerves. So the safe place, safest place to put it is right here. I have put it in my pumice. Or what do you want me to do? About to put it in one mine. I put it in knees. I put it in all kinds of places. So I'm waving at it. All my supporters. That's nice. So I'm gonna grab it. There's a grid, but I know where I'm putting it. Are you okay? Yeah. So I'm going to put 0.2 in each one. A standard dose, like what they would tell you, is to put, you know, four or five of the cc's in, maybe six. So I'm not doing that much, but she doesn't have that much fat. I'm doing this mostly to tighten her skin. 
And that's you, what we want. If she didn't have any fat, I couldn't tighten the skin. I've used it in knees, arms. Knees? You gotta have some fat there. We combine it with cool sculpting. And this is just a small dough, so you gotta show everybody how it looks tomorrow. Okay. So first it feels that was kind it? of funny. Was that it? Yes. Oh, that was not bad at all. I mean, it burns just a little. It's a big bag of ice, just so that it'll look awful, I guess. That looks horrible. <laughs> I can't take it. Well, wait a minute, just get the air out. Oh, this one's got air oh, out. That one better. Well, the air's out. Okay. Okay. So that'll help, and it'll help with the swelling, and then you can tune in and show people. So then we're going to do some Botox. Hi, supporters. <laughs> Did it hurt? Some no. Supporters. <laughs> so around her eyes, I can see this little vein, so I'm going to avoid that. Smile. Stop. So you can see that little vein. You okay? Of course. I trust you to do anything. I think the eyes hurt worse than the cavella. So if you have bows, we can mix it with cool sculpting. And then I'll get the side. Cool sculpting, I'll get the sides. Same oh. for the Kybella doesn't get. And it numbs it up real well, too, for the yeah. Kybella after. We do a lot of them together. Get the best of both. But you know what? Tell me what, darling. I did not sneeze. I know it's the first time. If you that is it. the first time ever I watched me sneeze. All you just hold your eyes open. Well, no, I mean, I don't even have to. Raise your I'm looking at that vein so that I can avoid it. Am I still getting love and support? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I know what it means to invite somebody. Who may knows I'd love to know. Raise your brows. I like to see where people move. I don't like to just put it in a certain pattern. So tell them, how's your neck feeling? I mean, I, it really didn't even, it burned just a, a, a bit, but, you know, I'm different though, but, <laughs> but it really didn't hurt. Somebody was telling me today she tries to watch to see how much people flinch. <laughs> well, I, I don't think I flinch. No, I flinch. But I mean, I don't think I hurt you that bad either. You never hurt. I did have the place that see it too late that we did all But that was, what? So, Cabela's price basically based on how much we use. It's a skin tightener and it also gets the fat. Um, I don't use it on people with big necks. I would use Cool Sculpting to debulk it because even if you look like a freak for a week, that's kind of too long because it's something you're already self conscious of. So, all that swelling is unnecessary. Plus, like Amy was saying, Cool Sculpting we get the size and you really shouldn't do that with Cabela. I put it in my pomas. Here, here, about, I've got a little one right there. My dad's got one on his arm. We treat, I mean, we treat all kinds of stuff with it. So you treat, like, the, the knees that have? Not it's just skin. Um, if y'all haven't seen Demi Moore's knees, has everyone, have you seen them? Uh-uh. Yeah. They're bad. You I mean, you just can't have surgery on your knees. So you, if you've got a little bit of fat, you can use Cabela. Well, I have turkey legs. Turkey, chicken legs. <laughs> the animal's out of it. I mean, you pick the man. Well, they're sticks. They're like stick legs. Okay. Any questions? Do we have any questions we can answer? Any questions? Let's see. It looks, I mean, it, it did not hurt. Jamie misses you. Hi. Christine, I can't hear you. Oh, everybody can hear you but me. Mm. Okay. Hello from Oxford. Hello. I love Oxford, Alabama. I used to go there all the time. Yeah, we can do a cool sculpting something. Terry Nan says hello. So Hi, show them your neck. Because people get scared that it looks bad. It doesn't. But if she had never had Cabela before, if she had a big fat neck, it would. In which case, we would do cool sculpting here and here, overlapping in the center. And for really dense fat, I would then do a little bit of Cabela on top. And it would be it'd be great. Okay. Will you all let us know if you have any questions, Terry? Will you show we'll them tomorrow? Yes. We'll post tomorrow? pictures. Yes. Post pictures tomorrow. Peace out. <laughs> all right. Y'all have a great day.